If spring signifies a form of rebirth, then the Iowa Hawkeyes are as ready for spring as any program in the country. Last year at this time, they were coming off an Orange Bowl win, were bringing back their senior quarterback, and had their sights set on not just a Big Ten title, but perhaps more. Five losses and a lot of trouble off the field later, it was a season to forget. So, in this year's spring game, a lot of holes to be filled and questions to be answered. Who's going to replace Ricky Stanzi, Adrian Claiborne, Darrell Johnson Koulianos, uh, Christian Ballard, Carl Klug, Adam Robinson, Jewel Han There's a lot of questions. Let's see if James Vandenberg could be one of those guys. This is early on in their scrimmage. Keenan Davis makes a nice grab from Vandenberg. A.J. Derby, a pass to Brad Herman here, just down the sidelines. And then, chance to see DeAndre Johnson run it up the middle for 12 yards. Offense looking pretty good. Vandenberg back at QB, 10-yard pass again to Davis, who had a pretty impressive spring performance. Great catch, keeping a foot in bounds there. Vandenberg, a little bit of trouble from Greg Castillo with an interception, and so an up-and-down day for the man set to replace Stanzi. Once it came scrimmage time, Jason White finds a hole on the right side, pushes it forward for 10 yards. Vandenberg again at QB, again. His favorite target, Keenan Davis. 25 yards, another acrobatic catch. Here's Vandenberg dropping back over the middle to White. Ball off his hands into B.J. Lowry's hands, and that will be all we would see from Vandenberg. Here's Kirk Ferentz now on his quarterback situation. I think after 15 days right now, James has a, a fairly clear edge, but uh, you know we're hoping the other two guys can co pull closer. They, they've both uh, done some good things and shown some progress, and uh, both still have a ways to go, but we'll go through August and see what happens. But I, I really think James right now is uh, the guy we're counting on. He's uh, you know, really took advantage of the last year and a half, two years preparation, and he's done a lot of good things this spring. So I think he'll be fine, and it'll be good to get some playmakers back on the field with him. Yeah, this Iowa team only brings back 11 returning starters. That's the fewest in the Big Ten. But there's not 100% certain you do have a leader for the QB position and for the running back spot as well. Marcus Coker ran for 219 yards in the Insight Bowl, which was the second most ever by a Big Ten freshman in a bowl game.